Hello everyone, and welcome to Tech Boost TV. I'm Jaime, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to install a hard drive into the HP Z420 workstation. The HP Z420 includes three toolless hard drive slots, so you will not need any tools for this installation. To begin, ensure your computer is powered off and the power cord is unplugged. Next, press and hold the power button until the blue light is completely shut off. This ensures all power is discharged from the system. Remove the left panel cover of the system to access the interior. This is done by pulling on the handle and gently pulling back on the panel itself to reveal the interior. Once you are inside, determine the next available hard drive slot by moving from bottom to top. If you have a hard drive in the bottom most slot, you will install your new hard drive into the next slot, slot 2, and so forth. Now, select the appropriate connection for your drive. If you are using a newer 6 gigabit per second drive, use one of the first two gray slots. If you have a third drive or just want a storage drive, feel free to use the 3 gigabit per second connection. We recommend using the fastest connection and hard drives together so you can fully take advantage of the system. If you are replacing a drive, first please disconnect both the power and SATA cables from the drive in the slot. You will want to pull these off and it may require a little force. Once the cables are disconnected, remove the hard drive caddy from the computer by gently squeezing the green tabs of the tray and pulling the tray outward. If you are simply installing a drive, follow the last portion of the next step. Each drive is mounted with four pins, which are covered by a blue rubber grommet. You will need to pull back on these to remove any installed drive. This is most easily done by pulling back on two of the pins on the same side and then sliding the drive out as shown. The plastic is very flexible, so it will easily bend to allow you to do this. Once you have removed the pins from the same side, the drive will slide right out. To install your new drive, simply reverse the process by aligning two tabs on the same side, letting them push into the mounting holes. Then it will be easy to get the other two connected. Once they are all connected, ensure all pins are flush with the system. Failure to do so could make the next step difficult to impossible. Now, begin to insert the drive as shown, making sure the push action is relatively smooth. Once it snaps in, plug in the SATA data cable you chose then plug in the power cable. Make sure to use the corresponding power connector, D1 for slot 1, D2 for slot 2, and so forth. Please remember these are keyed, so do not force the connection. If you are having difficulty, check to see the cable end is aligned with the hard drive connection. You can now leave the other power connections hanging in their individual bays for future use. Replacing the outer panel is fairly easy. Simply make sure to align the two areas highlighted in red. Once aligned, ensure the tops and bottoms are also aligned and push the side panel inward to seal the system. It may take some finagling, but it will snap in once aligned properly. Please check out our other how-to videos covering processor, memory, and video card installation, as well as an in-depth overview of the HP Z420. If you found this helpful, please hit the like and subscribe buttons below. We welcome suggestions on how to make these more helpful. Thank you for tuning in, and don't be shy about asking for other content.